think that's right. <gasps> Hi there, guys. Um, oh, God, I, I, you, you came in a little bit early there. A little bit early. <laughs> Welcome back to, um, my, um, my, my definitely blind playthrough of Tomb Raider Chronicles. Wow, it started us with no guns. Oh god, right. Yeah, welcome to the first segment of Ireland. I, or so I have been told that this is Ireland. Uh, I wouldn't actually know any better from looking at it. I don't know anywhere called Gallows Tree in, um, Ireland, to say the least. Can I, um, what's down here? Oh. Alright, that's an interesting start. Oh yeah, we have young Lara back, don't we? Same model from the beginning of Tomb Raider, uh, The Last Revelation, I believe. I'm not entirely sure it is exactly the same model, but... Oh wow. Okay then. Wait a moment. Am I seeing this correctly? I think they're supposed- these little textures here are supposed to be like rain hitting the surface. But because they're hitting the underside of the surface, it actually looks like it's raining upwards instead. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> I forgot to say, welcome to the first part of our Tomb Raider marathon as well. Yes, uh, it all starts here. It all goes downhill from here. Yeah, I'm gonna be marathoning the whole of Ireland in one streak. There might be a couple of interruptions because we do have some streams coming up, but, um... Yeah, it, it should only be like a day or so, you know, like, it, it won't be too much. And... Well, I think I'll probably marathon the final segment of this game afterwards. We'll just have to see. I'll have to see how this goes. For the record, I didn't get those one million likes, but, you know... Oh, fuck. Did they just increase the pitch on her screen? Can we pretend this never happened? Okay, thank you. Right, let's be careful this time. <laughs> I think I can hop down to there. I, I, I don't know, like, the, the scenery around here is a little bit confusing. Like, some areas, like over there, for example, I keep thinking I can see a ledge that I can hop over to. But, you know, I'm not. Definitely not, because that looks like a slope downwards. The only thing I can see that I can possibly do is hop down to there. And I think I would rather hop down here instead, because that looks a little bit dangerous. What's with this house up here? I haven't seen that correctly, right? There is a house up there. Can I maybe climb up here? How the fuck does whoever lived there manage to get up to their house then? I mean, oh god. To be honest, it's a little bit silly that Laura can't actually, like, climb up there, but, you know, whatever. Uh, it's Tomb Raider logic at the end of the day, isn't it? So let's run into here, hop down here, and my god, the camera angle is going completely haywire. Can I please see in front of myself? That would be kind of useful. At the oh my god. At the moment, yeah. <laughs> uh, a few of you guys are saying this is your favourite segment of Tomb Raider Chronicles. So I've been looking forward to playing it for certain. It looks like we're kind of... At the bottom of the, um, the fissure, or whatever, oh god, how, how do you say it? Fissure? Fissure. <laughs> For sure. Uh, <laughs> or crevice, crevice, that'll do, yeah. That, um... <laughs> that we could see from the top over there, right, uh... <laughs> oh god, I've been getting giddy a lot lately, I don't know what's going on with me. I swear to god, like, it's the heat. It really must be. I think we can hop into an area just over in that direction, though we most certainly can't now because I've hopped out- Oh, wait a moment, I can just climb back up again, never mind. Yeah, there appear to be like a little area over there, like a ledge. I don't know if you guys can see that. But I'm gonna try and make a jump over to it. I don't think I'm gonna quite make it, nope. Uh, is there any point in going up there? There might be a little bit of point because... Can we? Maybe? No. No, there's- there's nothing there. I don't think that's any use whatsoever, actually. Let's keep going in this direction instead. Uh, ooh. Okay, careful, Laura. And hop up here, I guess. There appears to be another little gap over here. I can maybe jump across to there. Mm. It's gonna be a bit tough, I think. I mean, I'm- I'm only gonna narrowly make that, I think. How far can I walk? Oh, up to there? Right, okay. And Laura's refusing to do a back step for me. Actually, she's refusing to do- oh, there we go. She was refusing to do anything at all. Had me worried for a moment. Let's try- oh, I can't really run from there. There? No, I'm not gonna make that. 
No, not going to make that. Let's go up this way instead. And through here instead. I think maybe we're looping around to the area anyway. Oh, small medikit. Why thank you, game. Why thank you. Uh... Huh. I do like the, um... Levels. To be honest, like, some of my favourite levels in Tomb Raider have been the ones where Laura's been completely harmless. I don't know, it feels like it adds a little bit more puzzle into the game, but... At the same time, like... Some of them have been a bit silly. Some of them. Well, let's climb up here anyway. I think that's the only thing we really can do at the moment. Can we... Can we climb up there? Oh, I see. I think we've got to hop into... Have we got to hop into there? Actually, that doesn't seem very doable. No, it really doesn't. Let's try swinging across here instead. Oh, we can't go around those. Can I hop over there instead? I can maybe climb up there. No, I think I definitely can climb up there. Oh, no, Laura doesn't like that either. Uh, was there anything behind it that I can maybe backflip onto? No. Hmm. I could possibly hop across there. No, I really can't do that either. Is there anything I can do? I'm up to the ledge that, you know, I couldn't get up to before at least. Oh, uh, huh. What can I do here then? It's not gonna- it's gonna be one of those levels where I just get stuck right at the beginning, isn't it? Maybe climb up here- no. Hmm. It's a lot of wonky scenery, isn't there? I get the feeling that I've gotta climb up there, but, you know, like... I'm not really seeing the- the start of it. I'm not really seeing the, uh, the first ledge that we can get up onto. It must be around here somewhere, right? Maybe... Maybe I- Maybe I'm just blind? I think... That might be the case. I don't know. No, that- that's useless. Ah, uh, fuck. Let's go around. Oh! Oh, so close. Come on. You can get up there, Laurie. You can do it. I know you're young and stuff, but... That would be an interesting mechanic. <laughs> if Laura's... Based on Laura's age, they deteriorated her ability. Like, for example, at the beginning of Tomb Raider, um, The Last Revelation, you play as Laura, but she's actually really shit and can't platform for crap, and it had some sort of variable to the game where you miss platforming all the time. <laughs> Sorry, just... That would be hilarious in a sense, but really, really not at the same time. I tell you one thing, all this jagged platforming really reminds me of Tomb Raider 1. A bit like, um, what the fuck is it called? The dinosaur level? Third level? Fourth level? I think it's the fourth level, can't remember though. That is jagged as fuck, like... It also reminds me of, like, Nevada from Tomb Raider 3. God, it's making me a bit dizzy falling off all these, like I'm losing my sense of direction the more it happens. Wait a moment, is this platform in front of me flat? What the fuck? It looks flat, but... Oh, there we go, right, there is a flat surface there. I didn't see that. Wait a moment, what the fuck are you doing, Lara? Apparently the surface is flat, like... Oh my god, she's stuck again! <laughs> Fucking hell! Oh, this keeps happening. She just becomes completely motionless, can I... There we go, okay, right! <laughs> okay, so we got our first aid kit. Um... I'm lost for ideas, I've actually been in this area for 10 minutes already. So let's hop down and let's go back up and then throw Laura at this platform that, you know, we could potentially get across to that I saw before. Can I even climb back up? Yeah. Laura, you're prepared to have your legs broken, it's probably gonna happen. What do I need to do here? I need to grip onto something, that's for sure. But, um, what exactly? I think that's the area that we're supposed to be climbing up to. Like. Yeah, that, that looks like it is. Um, oh, wait a moment. I see like a crack on the other side, just over there, where it's raining upwards. Maybe I'm supposed to jump across to there. I think that's probably the case, but is there a certain point that I'm supposed to do that? Well, obviously here, because this is the most sprung out area, so let's give this a go, shall we? Come on. Oh, okay, right, this is flat. I wasn't expecting that. Is there something else we can maybe do here? Might be, if we just walk to the edge. What's down here? Oh, I think that's... Is that just the platform that we land up on when we come in? It is, yeah. Okay. And what else we got? Okay, yep, we are definitely supposed to swing over there. So let's start shimmying over to the left. Oh, okay, god, that frightened me. Camera angle. 
uh, we get a nice a nice view of the the upwards rain I guess where it's been absorbed into the sky interesting mechanic by core design and am I safe to fall down here oh no this oh okay for a moment <laughs> sorry I hope you like my little song there for a moment I thought the entire thing was slopes and it was just gonna throw me off but apparently this game isn't re as relentless as Tomb Raider 2 is Right, where the fuck am I supposed to go from here, then? I mean, apparently I can... what? Uh, I might want to go back, actually. That doesn't seem like such a good idea. Uh, yeah, there's not much point in me falling off there by the looks of it. What else can I do? I can maybe go around that corner, but I don't see much point in that. And I can maybe fall down. What else can I do? Hmm. These look like noses. I'm gonna call them noses. Well, the noses seem a bit useless. Uh, I can possibly hop up there. But, I don't know, it looks a little bit too high. I will aim to land on that. And to try and jump over it in the first place. But I don't think it's gonna happen. No. Nope. Has not happened. Okay, let's start shimmying. We can maybe fall down a platform and grab onto that. Alternatively, let's keep going. Ah, right, there's a lowered area here that we can obviously get into. Uh, let's drop down then, and climb into here. So what do we have here? Nothing? Okay. Looks like there's something on the other side. I can't really see, unfortunately. Just hope that Laura's doing something right at the moment. Oh god, what the fuck? Am I still in there? Oh, right, okay, there we go. Oh, what the fuck? Sorry. Camera just does not want to work with me today, clearly. I think it's this level, it just... What's going on? Oh, oh right, here we go. <laughs> Stay with me, please, for just a second. Laura's controls seem a bit off. Oh, here we go, right. Oh, crap. Oh, god, okay, so we're safe here. Thank fuck for that. I thought I'd thrown myself off something then. Oh, whoa, 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 okay. Oh, right. We're okay. We're fine. So I don't want to fall down there, because that, uh, that means I have to restart everything again. I seem to be fairly safe around this area for now. Hmm. Is there anywhere else we can maybe climb up to? I mean, we can maybe get onto one of those platforms at the top there, but yeah. Not really seeing much else. It looks like we've got to do some sort of platforming here, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, no, no, no. We've got to hop over there. We've definitely got to hop over there, haven't we? So let's walk to the edge. Get ready. Oh, I think I will step over to this side, actually, just to get enough leverage, because it looks like this platform's a little bit sloped. And hop, and grab, and fail miserably. Okay, never mind then. Let's do it again. <laughs> but Alonso, you can just reload and save a bit of health, you know? Okay, so what else can we do to get over there? Ah. Uh. Not a whole lot, I'll tell you that much. Uh, fuck, what do we do? We can maybe jump down to that platform there. That said, I think that, yeah, that's not gonna work out. Could we shimmy across there? Mm, not really, no. Can we climb any higher? Maybe not. Can we go anywhere else? Are the noses gonna come in use? No, they're not. Silly noses. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe we have to shimmy all the way around this block. No, I don't think that's the case either. Oh god, what are we doing then? <sighs> uh, maybe I am supposed to hop down here? I don't know, though, I'm a little bit worried that if I try, I'm gonna fall down. Hmm. What might be best is I actually hop over to the ledge on the left-hand side here. Because if I do that, at least I can shimmy across and find the right area to fall down, if you get what I mean. Yeah, let's try that. Oh, okay, we're safe here. We're safe here. So this gives us more of a vantage point to maybe get over to that ledge. Though, once again, it doesn't seem entirely doable. Can I climb up here? No, I can't. Okay, let's walk around on here. Be very, very careful. I'm seeing a few flat areas that we can hop up onto. Wait a moment. Can I get on here as well? Oh wait. 
why would we get on there? Sorry, that's me getting disorientated again. Ah, can I, it seems just out of reach. Just out of reach, I think. I don't know. I think we can maybe make it. Come on, let's try. Oh, you fuck. Ah, oh, damn it. In all honesty, right, part of me really, really misses the, the, like, save and load system of Tomb Raider 1 and 3. Those games were the most frustrating, for the right reasons they were the most frustrating, because they were just flat out hard due to the save system, you know, and I like that. I really, really liked that, admittedly. Okay, I made a couple of attempts. I think I'm going to drop a save right here, because otherwise I'm just going to be repeating this over and over, aren't I? Throwing myself at this continuously. Maybe climbing onto there is a good idea. I don't know, though. I feel like Laura might bang her head if she does actually try. Maybe if I move a little bit further back. Okay. Let's try jumping from here, then. Hmm, that's bad. That's... Pretty bad. Uh, can I do a backflip, maybe? Like, where will that land me exactly? Oh, fuck. Damn it. Right, so... Is that important? No, that that's just there to throw me off, isn't it? Oh, you don't think... Oh, for fuck's sake. <sighs> Sometimes I just forget about mechanics, don't I? <laughs> Well, okay, I, I think I just spent about 15 minutes around this area. <laughs> oh, man. Thank you, music. That's reassuring. I'm making some sort of progress. Now, if the camera angle would kindly not leave me like every five seconds, that would be great. Okay, so we got an area we can slide down into there. But also... Um... Do I reload? Do I just accept that loss? <laughs> I'm suffering from a great amount of inner turmoil here, admittedly. Uh, I, I'm just gonna accept it. I'm gonna accept it. Oh, what's this about? Oh god, it's a bell from the beginning of the game. Did she just get goosebumps there? Oh! Come, child. Come closer. For I have gifts for thee. I'll stay where I am. <laughs> Fear not this visage. It is but a vessel for my troubled spirit. Come closer, for you are safe. While I am hung like so much butcher's meat. Who are you? Who? Mm, for it is more like what? Condemned to wander between the kingdoms of man and that of the elementals. <laughs> but I must be swift in my request. For they watch and wait to once more draw me back into the darkness. Request? My heart, girl. They have hidden my petrified heart in the roots of this, the world tree, down under the watchful gaze of the dragon Nidhogg. Find this, my child and return it to its rightful resting place. <laughs> and you shall be rewarded. And why on earth should I trust you? Not on earth, girl. In between. <laughs> My soul is gone, and how it fares, nobody knows, and nobody cares. <laughs> oh, 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 sorry, I'm, I'm just caught in the mid- I was just completely silent there because I was caught in the middle of being completely in awe of what just happened and sort of a little bit of shock as well. Number one, voice actor, fantastic, makes a damn change for Tomb Raider games apart from the people who normally do the voices for Laura Croft, you know. They're the only ones who've really been exceptionally good half the time. Number two... What? What? What the fuck? That 
was like it was that was right out of a horror. That that was cool. And I've always like the sound, like the creaking and everything. Oh shit! Maybe I don't want to jump in there actually. Oh wait, no, that's a that's a well. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to jump down there. Now, if the camera angle would kindly come back to me, that would be great. What? What the fuck are you? What? Why does that look like a tiny... A tiny version of... Oh my god, really? I passed past that. I did not go into it at all. Has that thing got a dick? No, I don't think that's quite what it is, but yeah, it looks a bit dodgy, doesn't it? Oh my god, what the fuck? Sorry, it looks like the- it looks a little bit like the, um... God, what the fuck is it called? From Pan's Labyrinth, the, um, the guy with the eyes in his hands, I've forgotten his name. Ugh, fucking hell, the monster from that, yeah. Thank you very much. Thinking about it, isn't there some sort of myth or legend based around Gallows Tree? Or did I just imagine that? Okay, here. Oh. Right, that's what happens. I wonder why the barrel kind of fell over. I'm guessing it kind of knocked itself over from within it to get out. Is there anywhere I'm safe from this thing at all? Can I maybe just get up here and it won't be able to get me? <laughs> what noises it makes. It kind of also reminds me of the children from Silent Hill. Um, the, uh... In the US version and the European- uh, sorry, the Japanese version. There's like little sco- oh, for crying out loud, what am I doing? I'm trying to get away from it and panicking and... Yeah, I don't know why, because like, it's slow as fuck. Uh, right. I mean, I can hop in the well, can't I? But if I get in the well, there is absolutely no coming back. And that does not- that does not sit well with me. <laughs> uh, sorry, my jokes are getting a little bit washed up, aren't they? Okay, so I can hop into it from this angle. That's if the camera angle would actually allow me to. But there's also a couple of other places I can go, I think. I mean, I could potentially... hop into this area here. Is that thing still following me? I think it's trying to get to me, bro. I don't think it can in some of these raised areas. Yeah, it's getting a little bit confu- oh wait. Yeah, it's getting- it, it really can't get me from here. Now, where were the other two areas that I could come into? I thought there was like, uh, I mean, I can- <laughs> I can get into the well, can't I? And then, did I see another area somewhere that I could go into, or did I imagine that? I think... I can't climb up there, can I? Yes, I can climb into here as well. May as well try this, but can't he just follow me straight in here? I mean, he sounds like he's very close to me at the moment. Yeah, I think he's following me. Pretty sure he's following me. He's definitely following me, isn't he? Isn't he? Yeah, he's there. Hello. Uh... Ah, let, let's keep running in this direction. Wait a moment, this is pitch black. What, what the fuck is in here as well? What's this? A... a fork of some kind? Excuse me, don't touch me. Wait a moment, can he even do anything to me? I don't know, he doesn't seem to be trying to actually kill me or anything. He just seems to want to follow me around. Oh, shit, okay, yeah, but he, he hurts me, alright. Well, I probably should have guessed from his red claws, but whatever. Oh, I, I think I saw this area from above, before. Now, what's this? A pitch for what? Okay then, a pitchfork, yeah, why not? Can I maybe break through this or something? No. Can I use the pitchfork on it? No, um... Don't have my guns, do I? I don't- I- I- I'm kind of guessing that Laura doesn't get her guns full stop. Actually. Because I don't believe young Laura ever did get her guns. Um, you know, we're in the Von Croy tutorial. At least I don't think she did, anyway. I keep thinking he's around me everywhere, like, I can hear him coming from different directions. Oh, right, we're just above here. Ah, right, okay then, um... Is this just the other side of the house, or... Am I imagining that? I can maybe hop over there. Is there any point, though? Can I maybe, like, jump from there to there and then... 
No, I don't think that's going to work, is it? Is there anywhere I can go at all? I, I, I keep thinking maybe I can see some sort of, like, bouncing platform puzzle or something, but... Maybe not at all. Yeah, I don't think that is the case. Definitely doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's climb down from here and um, try going one of the other directions instead. Yeah, we'll do that. What, what's he up to? Oh, he's just, he's just been sat patiently below us. We got the pitchfork from this area at least, but it is broken by the looks of it. Is that going to be any use whatsoever? Can I maybe get through here? Thank you. I'm glad he just kind of like slows down when he's getting closer to you, because it would be terrifying if he actually chased you around really quickly, you know. And... pinned you up against corners and stuff like that. That would be horrible. And I can go through here, can't I? So let's do that as well. Now, is... Yeah, I can't go over to the left by the looks of it, so let's go over to the right. Oh, wait. Okay, looks like I'm standing. Uh, water area. Oh, and I can possibly jump over here. Oh, shit. I hear something. Now, doesn't that sound... Oh, fucking hell, it is. Sorry, I thought... <laughs> I thought it was the wheel making the sound. It's the rats. I thought, I thought for a moment... I was about to say... That doesn't this sound like the rats from one of the older levels? That's because there's rats around. Now, where the fuck am I supposed to be going here? I mean, I can get up here, but there's not a lot of points. I think I'm supposed to be platforming my way over to the other side of this place or something like that. But whereabouts exactly? If I maybe get up here... Uh... Did they just disperse? I think they did, I think they just gave up. Okay, that's good. Uh, where can I get to from here? There must be somewhere I can kind of platform my way over to. I can maybe get up there and shimmy across, but... Uh, don't think so, actually. Is there anywhere in the water? Didn't bother checking, did I? Didn't want to check, because of the rats. Uh, hmm. I'm now realizing that there's more than one kind of house as well. I thought there was just the one before. No. Nowhere in here I can get to. Okay, well, let's get out again. I can maybe hop across there, but where from? No slope there. That's a little bit far back. What about... Oh, shit. What about over here? What about up there? That seems a little bit flat, doesn't it? I think I can maybe hop up to here. And then hop up to here, maybe? Yep, that's right. Okay. So, can I do anything from here? Maybe if I do a running jump in this direction? Oh, fuck. What the, what the hell happened there? Okay, I'll take that as a no. Maybe I can jump across from here? Wait a moment, I think... Probably the furthest across with the best angle is just by the cart. Though I don't know if I have access to that, actually. It might be in the way. Alternatively, can't I just shimmy across there? No, I don't think I can. I think it kind of ends there, doesn't it? And the slope's gonna, like, throw me off or something. Hmm. Ah, oh, dear. This is a bit of a toughie, this level. It certainly makes up for the, um... How easy the rest of the game's been so far, admittedly. Can I... No, I can't do that at all. Hmm. Maybe from here? Can I get past it? I can, just about. Wait, no, Laura really doesn't like it. No, she definitely doesn't. Ah, uh, fuck. What can I do then? Running? Jump, maybe? Over here? No? No. I think the only thing I've got left to do, really, is get in the well, then. Because I don't really have a bucket full of options, unfortunately. Oh well. Okay, so where's an angle where I can jump into it? I can from hopping up here, I think, if I face the right direction. What the fuck happened there? I thought she just- okay, whatever. Let's do it from like this, then. What? She's hitting invisible walls, isn't she? Oh my god, I am invi hitting invisible walls. What the fuck? I kind of need to get up, though, before I start getting molested by this little guy. 
though the camera angle really isn't doing me any favors at all, is it? Can I maybe do it from here? No, what the fuck? Okay, it doesn't actually look like I can get in there full stop. Um, am I right to think that? Oh god, he's on to us. He's moving kind of quick all of a sudden. Uh, maybe hop up to it from here? I don't know, though. I keep getting stopped by invisible walls. No, there is an invisible wall right there. It's not letting me in at all. So, what am I doing exactly? The pitchfork must be used for something. Maybe I'm supposed to use it at the root of the tree or something, I don't know. Um... No. No. Okay. Try the other side, perhaps? Like here? No. No. <sighs> no. No. Nothing. Can't get in there. Don't like it. Can I kill him with the pitchfork? Can I no. skewer him to death? No. 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 <laughs> ah! Ah, 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 ah! Right. More of this crap. Of course. 